uh, our younger members to come up here. I know we have a few here this morning somewhere. I want to share with you a little bit of an object lesson this morning. I always like object lessons. Don't do them as much as I used to, but uh, I want to share this with you. I've got a really simple, how are you this morning? Good, good to see both of you. Glad you're here. I want to show you two things. And I want you to hold, each of you take a moment to hold them. Then I'm going to ask you a question, okay? What's this? This is uh, how many pounds? Four pounds. Hold the four pounds. Hold it. Hang on to it now. A little heavy. There you go. Good. Okay. Now, to be honest, you to hold four pounds. Okay? Good. Now, what's this? It's a cross, right? Mm, straighten it out here a little bit. One that you wear. There. Which one do you think is lighter? Which one? That's right. Which one you think is lighter? I don't think we have it. That's right. So that would make sense, wouldn't it? The one's lighter. But which one is the easiest to put down is the one I'm asking you, okay? Which one is the, no, actually you're wrong, and I'll show you why. Hold this and put it down, then put it down beside you right there, okay, okay? Easy, right? This, however, is the cross, right? And this cross, we don't hold in our hand, do we? Where do we hold it? Where do we hold it? In our hearts, exactly. That's what Jesus said. Jesus said, pick up your cross and follow me. And what he meant was, not pick up a cross like this and put it in your hand, but pick up the cross and put it in your heart. Now, what did he mean by that? He meant that he, he, he carried the cross for us, right? And he suffered. For us, right? That's why he went to the cross. He loved us so much. So when he told us to pick up our cross or his cross and carry it with him, that meant we are to suffer for others. We're to have compassion for others that are in need. We're, we're, we're to have compassion and love for the stranger, for the people that are hungry, for the people on the street, for the people that maybe your friends don't like, okay? For the, the person that's new in school that no one wants to talk to or that people think are a, a, a creep or, or, or just don't want to be a part of them. They don't want them to be a part of their lives. We run into people, you don't have to be a, a, in school to have that. That happens all the time. Jesus said, that is who we suffer for, anyone who is in need. And this is something that when we pick it up, we can never put it down, not all of our lives. We can't just stop and go, well, everything's fine now. Everybody's okay. Hey, as long as I'm happy, everything's fine. That's not how it works. Jesus said, never, ever put this cross down. When it's in your heart, and sometimes it can feel heavy because we feel sad for other people, but then we can help them, can't we? That's what the church is for. That's why we work together, so we can ease the burdens of others. And that means we have to carry a burden in our own hearts. This is the heaviest thing we can ever hold in the world, ever, because we hold it inside. So let's remember that. That's why Jesus taught us to love others. We suffer for them, and then we help them so they suffer less. Okay? Let's pray. Please pray with me. Lord, Lord you, told us you told us to pick up your cross. Place it, in our hearts, Place it in our hearts and follow you. And follow you. Help, us to do this, Help us to do this. That when we see the suffering, see the suffering of, others, of others, we will love them, will love them and, help them. and help them. Amen. Amen. Thank you. See you next week.